Hello everybody, I hope you are all doing well. Um, so I thought I would join on today and give you a quick haul of everything I've got from um, like Amer American shops. So I got all these for using Stackery, a shipment service. And yeah, I consolidated a lot and these arrived today. If you want to use my link, I'll leave that in the description for $10 off your first shipment or just send me a DM on Instagram with anything you would like to know. Um, I am going to keep taking breaks um, in this video because um, we've got a bit of a mini heat wave here in the UK. I've had my mink foiling machine on, which is literally the temperature of an oven. Um, I've got lights on. Yeah, so I've got my drink and I'm just going to keep taking breaks, but I really want to do this video today and get it out to you. So the first shop that I ordered from was a little order from Caress Press. Um, so if you're not aware, my planning style has changed a lot and um, I'm doing minimal planning for weekly planning and for memory planning. I'm using kits, but only glossy kits and foiled. So this kit I've had my iron for a while and just thought I'd buy it while I was getting another kit um, and it's the Milky Way Cafe so you've got an extra four boxes. I think I got the very very basic kit. Um, oh it's good and um, it's got all glitter headers because um, I recently bought some kits and it doesn't have enough glitter headers which was annoying but that was my mistake. Um, so we have the four boxes um, some deco and work stickers, boxes, plenty of boxes, very much my style of kit. Um, lots of functional things to use. And this one came with a little freebie with palm leaves and a couple of scripts at the bottom. The next kit um, I got is a university style kit. Um, I am actually going into my third year of psychology at uni. Um, I don't move out to uni, I commute. Anyway, but um, I wanted a kit to mark the first week of term. Um, I actually got my timetable this week and I was very disappointed because um, we were told we're going to have some lessons in person, but actually everything is going to be online. So while that saves me travelling, it wasn't, you know, I paid for uni and I didn't even get probably like seven months out of it, <laughs> out of my whole degree and I'll be leaving next year, which is crazy. Um, so you've got the extra four boxes, just some general um, sort of stationary moving stuff. And again, this was the same format. I think the very basic one, I'm not too sure. There are quite a lot of options for that one. Um, I placed an order with Vanilla Paper Co. And she is lovely, like her shop is amazing and the quality is 100% amazing. But the thing that gets me is the shipping times. I did actually cancel an order, which kindly she very much did. Um, because I think her processing times are about four to six weeks. And with me using Stackery, like I ordered a summer kit and if it takes six weeks and then it wouldn't actually dispatch when she said it would. So by the time I get a summer kit, it's winter. So um, yeah, been amazing on um, the kits in our shop and foiling's always been good in the paper but it's just not practical being here in the evening. So this is the papaya kit. I might still be able to just get a use out of this one. Um, we've got a little freebie there. Um, this one's called Focus, which is lovely. This is sort of like a November kit for me, looking at the colors. As you can see, the foiling is lovely, but um, it's just such a shame. Um, and then I believe I got the mini Cruella kit. Um, I have watched Cruella and I use the Glam Planner kit. But um, yeah, I really like this art. And then she went and had a sew. I ended up buying the full kit rather than the mini this time around. Um, so we'll see what I do with these, whether I de stash one. So I got the full kit. Like in terms of foil, like the pricing is amazing. And we've got lemons here. So yeah, I just wanted to be totally honest with you about, you know, how I think nothing bad really at all. If I place an order in the future, I'll just bear in mind to probably go for the anytime kits rather than the seasonal. And another kit I bought, I believe this is the only kit I got from Scribble Prince Co this time, but I have got another order in of like Labyrinth and a couple of other ones I want. Um, and I got the exclusive art of Coraline 
and I watched this horror movie last, well it's not really horror is it, but um, yeah I watched it last year after all the hype and thought wow this is weird, but um, yeah I'm not like hugely into Halloween, but um, I had to get this kit just for the sake of watching it last year, <laughs> um, and I got the mini, which should be alright, but I'll find some other boxes to incorporate. So that's that one there and the freebie and also in terms of kits I think I got like a couple of oops pages yeah I got a few oops pages here got some headers oh one ton in a million stickers across scrub and go that paper is really really nice and I'm not too sure what kit that is from, but I'll certainly keep those as extras. While we're on the topic of Scribble Prints Co, um, I bought a de-stash mailer and then they were still, you. I think it was one per person, but then at a later date they became like unlimited amounts because um, they didn't all sell out. So I bought two of those and I also bought these last time and I think they're an amazing deal. I think it was like eight pounds for like eight dollars even for um, maybe 10 packs of foil. So ridiculously like a good deal. Um, yeah, so I grabbed two of those and I'll just show you. I will probably de stash a few of these because I have some and just some of them won't personally fit my planning style, but that's totally fine when it's so inexpensive. So I'll just do a picture of those. So yeah, as you can see, more than enough for like a year probably. But um, no, when it was such a good deal, I couldn't pass that up. And um, I'm pretty sure Scribble Prints go outsources the foil, so it's literally perfect. Um, just to show you a pack, this is definitely one I'll be keeping, so I haven't got anything like this one. Um, silver and gold. But I mean, just such a good deal for all those. So yeah, those are them. And then we have here, um two oily clips um i put one in my basket because i really liked it and then they had a sale so i went put it in my basket again checked out and didn't realize i had two in my basket rather than one um but it doesn't matter because um one of my planner friends elise is gonna have the other one for christmas she's watching this video probably but um she knows she gets she's getting it so it's no surprise um yeah so it's just the black plaid one I think or checker and here's the second one um yeah but that will just slip into a mortem but um I'm hoping that maybe in the future I'll have a black mortem as well um just to give me that bit of variety and I also do have a personal wide beige croco VDS on the way for Christmas which is very exciting and really scary at the same time um, but yeah, that will be for like my shop planning and stuff. And nearly last, we have a little one from um, Aura Estelle. Um, I went a bit Aura Estelle mad last year. I think I had probably, I think I had six Aura Estelles in the end. And I have the smaller bag. I kept the smaller bag and I've sold a few of my Auras. I can't get rid of them all, but um, yeah, I don't use them anymore. Um, and I do have a pre-order on the way, but I'm not sure what I'm doing with that one yet, seeing as I like change my style. Um, this one here um, is a Rose Quartz keychain, and this one is also for Elise. Um, Elise's favourite is the Rose Quartz. Um, funny story, we were at sh I, t I was going to keep this a secret that I was going to buy it for her. Um, and it's a good job I said because she was planning the exact same thing for me as well. Um, so it's a good job I mentioned that really. Um, seeing as we seem to be buying a lot of the similar stuff as well at the minute. And then for myself, whoops. And then for myself, I got the black 
keychain. Um, because I had the black bag, um, I was going to put that one on there with the gold keychain in there. So there, some little lovely, just little dainty key ring. Finally, to fit with my minimal planning sort of setup, I did an order from the planner press. Um, some lovely little bits from there. Um, I got this A5, I believe, acetate. I really enjoy sort of monoline prints at the minute. Um, which you'll also see in a video, um, maybe in a week or two, of um, a minimal planner haul from shops like Elise Illustrates, um, Colour Cafe and a few more I think I've got on the way too. And then I got this whole bag of little planner cards. Um, as soon as I sort of switched my other planners and made the order for the VDS, I went a bit mad on buying things but that's okay <laughs> um so i got um stay close to people who feel like sunshine uh, that's also for my friend um clear off your desk put your hair up grab a coffee and start and she continued a successful woman um and an ambitious as fuck um plan a card and then also uh, these were not cheap actually for <laughs> what they are, but 24k journal cards. So that is it from Sakari. So um, I think this was in total nine parcels consolidated. Um, but I'm sure I'll have another haul soon because I got Scribble Prince Co. And I ordered the Oda Clip Cross um, cloth and paper collab. So that would be exciting to show you. And yeah, if you have any questions about anything... Um, message me on just in the comments or DM me on Instagram about Stackery and I can give you a lot more information about that. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this haul guys. I'm hoping to put a bit more effort into YouTube. Um, yeah, and we'll see where it goes. Hopefully studio vlog is coming next week, sort of style of video. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. Bye.